Ah, oh, finally, okay. We are back, and we are back with 60 FPS. That's right, I finally got a new editor. You can stop complaining. Or actually, no one was complaining. But I'm complaining about the 30 FPS and crappy quality that there was with my last editor. But anyways, enough of this complaining from me. Let's actually get into the real footage. It's kind of difficult keeping up with posting at least one of these a week, especially when I want the content to be actually good. It can take a while sometimes, and I don't always have enough stuff to really fit into a 5 to 10 minute video, it's just sometimes not possible. But nonetheless, I have done a few things as usual. The main thing I've been working on currently is my boss fight, and I think it's looking pretty cool. I think I'm just gonna leave it the way it is, but you can see here, it's got a nice little health bar, nice little icon that animates just in blinking, and it's got some really cool animations too. I think uh, some of my better animations that I've made are from this guy. You can see you get close to him, he'll swing his thing, and then when he jumps, he'll create like a shockwave on the ground. So you can't be near him when he does that, otherwise you're gonna get hit for a lot of damage. Like you saw right there, he does like 5 damage per hit, and only increases as his HP goes down, so you have to be really really careful. But yeah, he's really cool, he has some foreshadowing and some nice little dialogue, and I think he's just a great addition to the game. Or she, however you look at it, I don't really know. But yeah, I've been focusing on some other projects in the time being. This is pretty much all I've done besides the normal just bug tweaks and animation tweaks and stuff like that. The main thing I've actually been working on, like the main project I've been working on in the past couple weeks is this uh, this game jam. Or actually, not, even, not the past couple weeks, only for like one day. But still, it's something I've been focusing on uh, a lot more like intensely, I guess you could say. But uh, I'm going to show some clips of this right now. It's a game called Grapple Night. I think that's what we're gonna call it. It's uh, it's a pretty it's a pretty cool concept. It's a pretty simple concept too, though. You're a knight who can just jump around and will grapple on to blocks and objects, and will have to avoid obstacles and use their own intelligence to get past some of the levels and some of the structures that may be in their way. You have to sort of understand and learn the physics of how the chain swing works and how to actually use it. And when you do learn it, you'll be able to explore your way throughout the level and eventually complete it. And of course you can grab checkpoints along the way. So that's a pretty cool project I've been working on with a, a fellow indie game developer uh, called Battles Days. You can go check him out if you want. A link will be in the description. He's doing the art for the game in case you were wondering. But yeah, I've also been working on a, another side project and I know what you're saying. Another side project? How many projects can you have at once? Well, three. I'm gonna go ahead and play some footage of this other game I've been working on real quick. I think it's really, really cool. I feel like once I'm done with the current game that I'm working on, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to full gear on this other one that you're just seeing. And it's it looks pretty cool so far. The concept is that you're basically this miner, and you're going down in these different cave levels and these layers of caves, and you have to go and mine stuff and collect stuff and defeat enemies and make sure you don't die along the way. And then you have to go and go back up to the surface, and you have to like sell what you've got to upgrade and get new weapons and stuff like that. It just seems really cool to me. Uh, I've just had I've had that idea for a little while and decided to go ahead and put it into motion. But yeah, that game is going to be probably not something I'm going to be looking at for a very long time. So you won't be seeing or hearing from that project probably anytime soon. But yeah, this is what I've been doing in the past couple weeks. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this was kind of a short video. But I feel like I have to at least get something out, even if it is short, to make sure people are updated on what is going on and what I'm doing. That way they can go and find my projects.